In the 20 years since the 9-11 attacks, America worked with its allies to establish peace and freedom in the Afghanistan region. We gathered here uh, at the deadline for the U.S. withdrawal from Afghanistan to dedicate this memorial behind us to remember all the soldiers, airmen, sailors, and Marines who died, and all of the families impacted in the quest of creating a better world and a better country. We would especially like to honor the 13 brave soldiers whose lives were taken by a suicide bombing in the final days of our exit from Afghanistan. Most of the soldiers were in their early 20s, their adult lives taken away just when they were beginning. They grew up in a world where the United States of America had liberated a nation from tyranny, restored the rights of women and girls to attend school, and pursued their own happiness protected, we protected unknown people in a far away land from those who wished to terrorize them. Their service to their country and to the world was so trusted that total strangers were willing to press their children into the hands of U.S. service members, desperate, even at the price of separation, to ensure that their children had a chance to grow up free. May the spirit of their service and the power of their bravery live with all of us, especially those who were left behind. Today is the last official day of the war in Afghanistan, and we give thanks for those servicemen and women who came home to family, for those who went home to God, thank you. Thank you for defending us. Thank you for uplifting us. Thank you for making the world a better place.